McLean interviewed Steps and within about a half an hour of him interviewing them, they split up. Let's have a look and see what caused it. Now, viewers, if you've been watching over the Christmas period on The Big Breakfast, you'll know that one part of the show that has been a, a major success where others have failed, uh, honesty, biggest policy of mine, is this. They're not out in the shops yet. They will be next year. It's my McLean's machine. There it is. They haven't switched it on yet, you spanner. Yes, it's this, McLean's machine. Via technology, it comes up with the uh, questions human TV researchers can't be bothered to ask. But today, viewers, I'm bringing you a very special edition of this. McLean's Machine on tour. Today's guests on McLean's Machine have had a fantastic year, filling out arenas, winning awards, and now they even have their own pasta shapes on sale. They sing, they dance, they get stuck in the bottom of your saucepan. Will you please welcome Steps, everybody? Uh, via one. One's ill. One's ill, isn't it? OK, OK, that's fine. Now, guys, it's been a few years since you've had your first hit single, and I think it's fair to say that you've probably been asked every question known to man. Is that right? Probably, mm. yes. Can we big it up? Yes! Yes, yes. yes Mike! We've been, we've been drinking night, nurse. <laughs> and day as well. Well, <laughs> it's about to change because me and the big breakfast boffins have input, every input of data about you into this machine. Okay. With Fantastic. one press of a button, Good this machine will deliver <laughs> questions that you have never been asked before. I will now input some data into the machine. Lee, favourite colour? Black. Yeah. Now I'll put that rubbish into the machine. Not yet, I haven't turned on yet. And now switch, I'm switching on the machine now. There, the machine is now warming up. As the machine warms up, we will put out a question. It will put out a question. Not you muppet in here. There's, there's the question. Lee, I'd like to open this up now. What's all this about having a ritual of mooning out of a window every time you visit a new country? Is that true? Um, it is true, actually. We were in Ireland and Lisa did. Did she move? Moon out the window, yes, yeah. yeah, she did. We used to do it every new country. She used to do it out of every window, but until she got caught by the police. <laughs> she unfortunately did it to um, a plainclothes police car, sort of, yeah. next to us, and they pulled up and got out. And what did they say? Car on she the road in Dublin on a she Friday night. Yeah. So, is it fair to say, probably there's a police station somewhere, you know, you get them wanted pictures. Yeah. There's a wanted <laughs> button yeah. with a number on the bottom. <laughs> You read to Lee, Lee, read to Lee. You were once King Herod in a nativity play. Is it true that you went home crying to your mum because you didn't want to be one, the one that killed Jesus? It's true, actually. Is it? Yeah, I'm a soppy s Yeah? Mm. Did you cry? I did. <laughs> Here we are, first three. Just uh, fire away. Can I just point out these machines that aren't in the shops yet? If there's other pop stars watching, um, these will be in the shops next oh. year. <laughs> what is it? How, is it a finger? How did you get your finger back so quickly after the birth of your third child? Hey, well... <laughs> That's it. Right, put it in. Uh, Could have had somebody's eye out with that. I'll read this one. I'll read this one. Uh, this is probably... Who's this for? Let me see. Claire. Oh. Is it true that you've re revealed your breast to some important American <laughs> industry executives? <laughs> is it true that you whopped them out? to some important Americans. I miss that one as well. Is it true? Yeah. It was an accident. How was it I an accident? Do you don't just go like that. Oh, no, oh it's an accident. <laughs> Sorry. No, we just done a showcase and I had my costume was a bikini top and I went like that to and straighten the strap and it just pinged up in my face. Well, thank the Lord it wasn't Judy Finnegan doing it. That's all I can say. Uh, last one. Last one. Okay, last one. There we go. It's what is it? You just... What attracted you to the magic millionaire, Paul Daniels? Yeah. Surely that well... should be for Debbie. <laughs> well, listen, thank you very much indeed. Pleasure chatting to her. They are the, the best... I wish you a best Christmas, best New Year, best whatever. Yeah. Did you get what you wanted at Christmas? Yeah. Yeah. I'm sure you did. <laughs> uh, that was Steps. McLean's Machine on tour. Uh. And our report by splitting up. Yes, it is. That was steps, as he said. So, Mike, you wished, you wished them a happy Christmas, but somehow your wish didn't come true because they've had this, <laughs> this very difficult split. And I understand that, uh, for example, Faye is deeply unhappy. Were there signs that there were that they were about to signs break up, Mike, rift. when you were there? I've got no sound. <laughs> Mike, I can, I, it, go, it Mike, talk to again. It came. Can you hear me now, Richard? I can hear you now, Mike. Yay! Yeah. Um, it came as a, a big shock to me 
um, when they when they announced. I remember the it's it's one of those evenings where you remember where you were when Kennedy got shot. I remember when it was when the <laughs> it was announced the steps were splitting up. I was in the kitchen. Well, it was Christmas kitchen. Day. I should hope you do know where you were. <laughs> yeah, and and it just you know it's it's hit me hard, Richard. I'll be Has honest, it? you know. Um, there was no signs there at all whatsoever. No. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm I overcome with emotion. Matt, how long ago was that interview recorded? Uh, three weeks ago. Three weeks and ago. And we did stay to him on the tour. We said, it's your gold tour, are you splitting up? And they said to me, no. And I never they put lied. steps down as liars. Yeah. <laughs> I know, I know. They blatantly lied to my face. Yeah. Um, you know, I just don't know what to say. I, know, you know, I, know, I, don't, I know. I don't know whether you're happy about the split or sad, Mike. You look well, I just think, you know, I'll be honest, I'll be honest. I think steps... Without them boys, are nothing. <laughs> um, they, I think them boys will go on to great success. Yeah. Um, I think the girls are going to struggle. <laughs> um, they and, are going to struggle. And also, Lisa, Lisa wasn't present for your interview. Was that a sign of the rift? Do you think they've oh, already fallen out? You, know, you don't need to be Yuri Geller to uh, be switched on. <laughs> um, it's obvious, obvious. Five trailers, all different names. <laughs> right. As obviously, you, you were the, the last um, reporter to get an interview with Steps before they broke up. Do you feel like the journalist that missed the scoop? <laughs> no, I mean, look, think about it, Richard. I did Mariah Carey. She went cuckoo after our interview. <laughs> I've, done, I've, I've done Steps. They've split up. So here, say, if you want an interview... <laughs> <laughs> oh, McLean.